Charlotte Chuck Grumman, accessibility consultant, designer, and advocate. Cultural accessibility and what it means to me is the idea that we are welcoming people in spaces of all kinds, whether that is a theater, whether that's a museum, a festival, a library, anything that brings people together in a community sense, in a cultural sense. Physical guidelines are a lot easier for people to adhere to. It means that people can use the resources in a way that's easier to get there, but if they're not creating both social and cultural accessibility, they're not creating a wholly accessible experience. Cultural accessibility includes what people will experience when they arrive. So wayfinding tools on websites, maps. It includes tour guides, whether that's ASL tours or touch tours. At a young age, I was identified as neurodivergent. I was identified as being on the spectrum, having sensory processing disorder. I had every use of accessible technology available to me. And as somebody who used those services my whole life, I felt like I was in a unique position to advocate for people who weren't able to advocate for themselves. Because as a person on the spectrum, there are ways that you are expected to behave when you enter a space like a museum, like a theater. And for some people, behaving that way can feel unnatural and uncomfortable. And so my work in accessibility is to work with sound designers, lighting designers, and the director, um, and work on adjusting cues and sounds so they might not be as overwhelming. I'll make tactile representations of spaces, whether that is through a 3D printer or through balsa wood that I glue together to create a touch tour or tactile representation of something to try and create a world within the world they've created on stage, but for the audience. We're not changing any of the artistry. We're not trying to give away the mystery of these shows, but we're trying to give as much context that somebody who would need it could really benefit from getting all of that firsthand. The goal of making places like this not feel so formal and cold. I'm definitely not the first person to do it. I just might be the first person that you met doing it.